Hi, I just always wondered, um, what what was a working day or working week like, especially back in the 80s, for someone like you who was doing so many characters on so many shows? Um, were there <laughs> several actors in the same room? Were you doing several shows in a single day, or how, how did the... How did your work schedule actually actually unfold? If if we were lucky, we would have maybe half the cast of Transformers because as the show uh, went on, the cast became huge because more and more characters were developed. Um, but we were all so busy that I remember you would be scheduled for such and such uh, in the morning and then such and such uh, around midday and then another one you'd have to do pickup lines for something you, you had done the week before and that was just you. They tried to get the whole cast generally but it was impossible to do at that time. As I said, there were so many shows being made. It was a, it was a real golden time for, uh, oh, yeah. for us. Oh, yeah. um, we were going from session to session to session. And working every day. Yeah. Which when is an unusual thing for an actor. I was, I, was, I was based in London at the time and, and L.A., and I was doing a movie in London a Monday and Tuesday and then flying back TWA and doing Hanna-Barbera Thursday and Friday and then flying back to London for Monday and Tuesday. And that went on for six weeks. Wow. So we were busy. Yeah, very busy. Yeah, they tried. Most there, of the time. there were a few when we first began Transformers. They had pretty much all of us there, and it was quite a quite a gas. You know, somebody had mentioned this book, so let me do let me do my plug, if I may. Uh, I wrote a book called Bumblebee and Me, which is the story of the making of the G1 series, and uh, it, there's a lot of anecdotes in there, and there's pictures, and it, it actually talks about the sessions and what went on in the sessions, and I also mentioned many of my fellow actors, my my friend Alan included. Uh, so if you're interested, we are we are selling those at uh, at the table uh, in the uh, what what room is it? The, uh, the autograph room. Yeah, the, well the autograph. Yes, in the autograph room. Thank you. It's in the Vienna room. Other. Yes, they're they're all named after like little uh, European cities. We're in the London room, by the way. <laughs> also, as long as I'm mentioning stuff, this is important. We have a pair of special auto or a TFCon 2014 mugs that we're running a raffle for. The raffle tickets are a dollar a piece, and the proceeds are going to go to Hasbro Children's Hospital. So if you do get a chance, uh, mm -hmm. stop by and, and buy a ticket or two. Even if you don't win, you'll be doing something good in the world. Okay? Thank you. I'm done. Very nice. Thank you. Very nice. Okay.